November 2022 full moon in Taurus, from a full moon in Taurus to a new moon in Sagittarius, from a Leonid meteor shower to a total lunar eclipse, observances this November bring us important days to celebrate. A total lunar eclipse appears on November 8th. This lunar eclipse is a time when we are forced to change in an inward way, taking into account the ways in which we are failing ourselves, and to rid ourselves of these patterns. If you've been longing for a relationship to improve by waiting for the other person to change, the lunar eclipse will present you with the facts. You either need to accept the other person, or change yourself. The full moon in Taurus appears on November 8. The full frost moon is one of the names given to the November full moon, but it's most often referred to as the beaver moon, a nickname inspired by nature. Native Americans, looking to keep track of time, named the full moons every month based on what was happening in nature. During this full moon we learn to let go of drama, power plays, and being overly materialistic. We're moving toward appreciating basic values, being calm and feeling safe and secure. Simple pleasures and creature comforts take on elevated meaning. It is the perfect time for setting intentions for what we really want to achieve. This beaver moon is also a total lunar eclipse, giving us a six-month time frame for manifestation for any intentions we set during this ecliptic cycle. From the point of view of emotional stability, a full moon focuses mainly on inner satisfaction. Only if we are satisfied with our past decisions can we feel good physically. The basic problem of the full moon in the Taurus zodiac sign may be self-respect, because things in life will seem more difficult than they really are. Our past decisions will be under fire from our own self-criticism, which will cause a negative view of the world. A suitable solution to transform this more negative aspect into positive vibrations would be to find one's own inner peace. It's a time to focus no more on global issues. At least these days, we have to focus on ourselves. Don't look for problems where they aren't. On November 9th, there will be Uranus at opposition. It's at its closest approach to Earth and its visible face is completely illuminated by the Sun at a magnitude of 5.7. The spiritual lesson of the Uranus opposition is that you will come to terms with your perception of life and its true meaning. The outside world is not as important as it was in the past. Accomplishments will have to mean something to you on the inside. You will no longer live for approval and applause from the outside, world but rather seek spiritual fulfillment. If you don't work towards spiritual fulfillment in the years following the midlife crisis, life may grow empty and meaningless. But if you choose to work from your spiritual side, you will find the midlife crisis to be a true blessing. On the night of November 17th to 18th, the peak of the Leonid's meteor shower occurs. During these nights the moon will be pretty thin. So you won't have any moonlight. Meteor showers symbolize beauty rising from ashes. Meteor showers represent the spiritual insights and wisdom gained from looking deep within the shadows of ourselves and our world. They invite us to create new ideas and beliefs. They're like little bursts of ha moments. Meteor showers can be quite the spectacular sighting and are sometimes very rare. The new moon in Sagittarius, located during the week of November 23rd is your last chance to experience the galactic center of the Milky Way shining in the sky in 2022. It is time to bring a quiet sense of intention and presence into your life. As you allow yourself to rest, spend some time journaling and exploring what is in your heart of hearts. Give yourself extra time in meditation by walking mindfully in nature. Go outside and soak in the energy of this new moon, giving thoughtful appreciation of the beauty of darkness. Enjoy the stars that can be seen when the moon is hidden in shadow. The end of November casts an exceptionally positive aspect into our emotions, which harmonizes our inner energies and gives us strength and ambition. From this time until the first days of December, we have tremendous energy to take on even the most difficult tasks, which we will complete with determination. The end of November reminds us how important a positive attitude of our mind is. The sun in the sign of Sagittarius will bring us more energy and the desire to live life to the fullest. So what emotions we experience in November depends very much on our own inner setting. 
Join us at www.secretserendipity.com where great insights reveal deep discoveries. Where great insights can impact future choices and attitudes. Where we strive for a deeper understanding of the power of the universe.